Happy Vlogmas, everybody. So today I'm going to go and take my wall hanging into the city and I'm gonna go to the um, garment center and there's a place where you can go get grommets. So they have like a big machine where they put like really sturdy grommets into whatever you want. You just have to mark everything and um, ask them to do it and they do it for you and they just like stamp it in. So it's a really cool process. I'm gonna take you guys with me to show you how it's done. And we can kind of do a little tour of the garment center. I haven't been there in a long time, so hopefully it's open. We'll see what's, what's going on there at the garment center. It's in Midtown Manhattan. And um, I'm just really excited to get this wall hanging like shipped off to my friend, done. It's just been an amazing project that I've been working on and I'm just excited to like cross it off the list. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more dyeing tutorials, sewing tutorials, and art projects. Um, I really appreciate you guys and um, I'm excited to show you a little bit of the Garment Center. So here's a photo of the whole wall hanging and you can go see the video I made about it. Um, I'll put a link in the description below and I'm going to mark where I want the grommets. I'm doing them every seven and a third inches. So the whole thing is about a hundred inches just for scale. It's really big and I just need them to be all equally spaced. I'm walking to the subway just because I could take the bus, but it's a really nice day today and I just wanted to kind of get some steps in. And it's a really pretty walk. I'm going by the park. And then I'm going to get on the train. Get my coffee. Get a walk by the park. Hop on the train. Union Square. It's a pretty day. It's not very crowded. People are starting to set up for the holiday fair, I guess, or I don't know, people just sell stuff here all the time. But it's still pretty early in the morning, so it's not set up yet. Garment Center. I'm having a lot of memories come back. I used to work around the corner and I used to design sweaters. It was my first fashion design job and I used to come to this store all the time for buttons. We would get our samples in from China and the buttons would be like not very nice. So we'd go here and get new buttons and sew them on to make the sample look pretty. I guess they're out of business, which is sad. And then I used to go there too. This is a really fun store. Rhinestones. And I'm gonna take you into the rhinestone store. It's pretty fun to go in there.
honestly just have a great dye here. There's the giant button and the tailor. These are the sculptures of the Garment Center. And then we're gonna go find the Garment people down the street. I just gave it to him and I picked out the grommets I liked. It's a really tight space in there so I didn't really want to stay in there but um, he said just give them 30 minutes and they're going to put the grommets in so they do it in the back otherwise I would love to show it but I can't really go back there. So anyway. So I'll just wait, hang out, enjoy Midtown. <laughs> Sorry. This is like a sequin store. Sequin, beautiful dresses. She's coming to say hi. <laughs> so this is where all of these stores are. And if you want to come find fabric, oh, this one looks like a good one. There are lots of sales. You can find a lot of really cool, unique fabrics that are like specialty things. It's a really fun place to go. So this is all menswear sort of fabrics. It's like wools and shirting fabrics. Really cool place to check out. Beckenstein's. I remember when I was a freshman, the first project that we did was sewing a tailored shirt, which is like actually very hard for like a brand new sewing student. I knew how to sew, but a lot of people in my class like didn't know how. And we all came here to pick out our shirting fabrics. <laughs> and uh, yeah, made our shirts. Every kind of thread you could ever dream of. I see patterns. I'm going through these patterns and like look at this crazy ottoman pattern. I don't know what the way this would make, but it's insane. Sorry, I'm trying to get this in front of my tripod. So they have all these like vintage patterns. This one is really cute. I feel like you could make like so many things with this. It's like endless. What a treasure trove. And there's clothes, home decor, every single decade. Wow. I didn't even know this was here. This is amazing. What? $7? Oh my gosh, this is like a Trinity coat. That's cool. Wow. That's kind of interesting. 
lot of toys. Oh, poncho. Okay. I like to kind of, you know, I have so many patterns that I don't use, but I like to look at them. Pretty. Ooh, that's cute. Well, it's almost time for me to go pick up my grommets or my quilt. So I might have to leave this place. But I mean, everything you could ever dream of here. Lace, rickrack, batting, all here for you. Oh my gosh, look how beautiful. Professional. This is so much better than anything I could do. So you guys punch it. And then you put the grommets in, right? Okay, so it's a total of 14 grommets. And they look nice. Oh, this is so exciting. All right, okay. Thank you so much to Star Snaps. <laughs> okay, so I'm about to pack this up. And I think the grommets look really great. I'm just kind of looking it over one last time. Can't wait for my friend to get this wall hanging. 